Game two between the Blue Jays and Indians. The Jays winning in extra innings on opening day. Obaldo Jimenez pitching because he appealed the suspension. He will drop that appeal right after this start. Top four, Kelly Johnson pop up and Shelly Duncan in foul territory making the sliding grab. Well done from Shelly. Go to the bottom of the fifth inning. Brandon Morrow on for Toronto. Casey Kochman. Little swinging bunt. J.B. Aaron Sebia's throw off the mark. So Kochman able to reach. And next batter, Jason Kipnis, takes full advantage with a two run blast his first of the season. Two nothing Indians. That was the only hit allowed by Morrow in seven innings. Both runs unearned. And that's all he allowed. Back to Ubaldo, top seven. He's working on a no hitter. Here, wild pitch. Carlos Santana goes to second base, and Adam Lind is in there safely. So men on at second and third, and very next pitch. The no-hitter, the shutout, it's all gone as Brett Laurie drills one into center field. Two runs come in and score, and we're tied up at two just like that. Obaldo gives up two runs on one hit in seven innings, a well-pitched ball game. Ninth inning, Kelly Johnson at the dish in a tie game. Breaking ball. Hit high and deep to center. Brantley at the wall, at the trap. Home run. Kelly Johnson, his first of the season. Brantley was right on it. But it was beyond his reach, and the Blue Jays have taken the lead here in the night. Comes off Vinny Pistano. We go to the bottom of the inning. Sergio Santos looking to save it for Toronto, but it's Drubal Cabrera with a home run of his own, his first. Ties the game at three, and for a second straight ball game, these two are going to extras. Top 12, two on for Rajay Davis. Base hit into center field, and Carter Schoen will score. Laurie is headed for third. He's keeping his eye, and he's going to try to score. Here's the relay throw. No throw as Laurie scores from first. Jays had two more in the inning to go on to win it by a final of 7-4. to four. So two straight extra inning victories to begin the season for Toronto. Francisco Cordero gave up a run in the 12th, but before he came in, Morrow, Darren Oliver, Santos, and Casey Jansen combined to hold the Tribe to just two hits through the first 11 innings.